Hi everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I know it's lovely to see lots of makeup on my channel but I did decide to do something a bit different today so I'm going to go through my skincare. Um, it's really important to make sure that you look after your skin when you're applying makeup and taking it off and things like that. And I'm just going to go through my skincare and hopefully that you will pick up some tips and tricks along the way. So if you want to see what I use on my skin then just keep on watching. So first up to cleanse my skin, I'm going to use the Elemis Pro Collagen Cleanse and Balm. So this is like a butter consistency, so it's really creamy and less is more. It is also anti-aging. Just to prove to you how much I love this product, um, you can see how little is left in the jar. And so to use this, I'm literally just going to get my ring finger here, so this one here, and I'm going to just scrape a little bit off the edge. As you can see, there's very little left, and just scrape it along my skin. With skincare, a lot of people think that they have to load it on, but I literally scrape it on my skin. If I need to go in more, I can go in more, but just scrape it on. Rub it into the skin. You can leave this on for a couple of minutes if you want to or you can take it straight off. It's completely up to yourself. It is hydrating as well so it will give your skin a little bit of a boost if you want to kind of double up as a mask as well. But I like to leave it on. I find it really good for breaking down the makeup as well. Okay, I'm really sorry about all the noise outside but my brother has decided to mow the lawn. Thanks, Bill. So um, we're just going to pretend that noise is not happening in the background. <laughs> to remove this cleansing balm, I'm going to use the Cleanse Off Mist. Um, here I got mine on my website, but I'm just going to dampen that and then wipe it away. I normally use actually, um, there are like little mitts that I get from pennies as well. I have like face lots and stuff like that. So you don't have to use one of these. Personally, I got these after hearing all the hype and I was raging because I used Inglot 77 gel liner the very first time to take it off and it like stained my mitt. So I was a bit annoyed over that because I literally had only used it once. Um, whereas I use penny mitts and like you get three in a pack for three euro so it's not the world's worst but this was like a fiver I think now I know that's still not expensive but um you know I thought for a five when I can get three for three euro and they stain you know I don't know it's maybe I was just maybe it's just me but I was expecting it not to stain um after the first use for my second cleanse, I'm going to go in with another Elemis product, Dynamic Resurfacing um, Facial Wash. So I like this because um, it's actually exfoliating on the skin as well. This is just a little sample bottle, but um, because I've actually run out of mine. But again, I'm scraping it on the skin with my ring finger. Um, it smells really nice. Um, but again, I like to use this because I would get clogged pores and I find this is really good. Now I wouldn't use this every day because my skin is a little bit sensitive and I can't really go for much. Um, it's not a harsh product but it is active so again it, it will exfoliate your skin. So I'm going to just rub this in and you can see it foaming up here now. It is foaming up because I already have wet my skin. My skin is wet from taking off the other cleanser so, and the more you lather your skin with water, with this product on, the more it will foam up. Now again, you can leave this on for a couple of minutes if you want to. I'm just wetting my hands there, just to bring that up a little bit more for me. And again, I'm going to wipe this, this, this product on here and I'm going to wipe this product off again with my cleanse off mist. Of 
to tone the skin i'm going to use another elements product and this is the Sudan apricot toner i love the smell of it this is for sensitive skin as well um because it's soothing on the skin but i actually bought it in the kit for something else and then i ended up falling in love with this toner um you can spray it onto two cotton pads or you can just spray it on your face just like what i did but i I love the smell of that toner. I'm not going to exfoliate my skin today because dynamic for surface and wash. So I just don't want to kind of overwork my skin, but I am going to go in with a mask. Now this is actually a sample size. So this is the Elemis Superfood Berry Boost Mask. And it is a purifying mask for the skin. I have used this before and it smells amazing. So I'm just going to squiggle that up. So it's purple. And again, with my ring finger, I am Pulling it, scraping it onto the skin. I just like to scrape everything onto my skin because I just feel like I'm not putting twice too much product on any particular area. And if I have to go in with another scrape of it in a different area, then that's okay. But I'm not putting a big clump and wasting half my product because skincare is expensive. So you want to get as much out of it as you possibly can. This smells amazing the superfood range is exactly what it says on the tin it is food and it is feeding your skin with all its nutrients and all the goodness that it means And I have to leave that on for 10 minutes. This is the mask on. I've literally just applied it. And I just wanted you to see so it's a light. So it's a light purple colour. Kind of like um, a lilac -y colour. But just so you can see there. So this is the mask um, after it's been on 10 minutes. So I'm, I do find it like hard to like move my face. But it's not like to the point where I can't move it. I just need to... You can see there now. So it's kind of like a dirty colour. <laughs> Kind of like dirty purple or something like that but um yeah so this is it after about 10 minutes um you just kind of have to it's not like really really tight on your skin so don't be thinking you're like oh my god i can't feel my face you can um but just be aware that it is a little bit tight to take this off i'm going to actually use one of my little mitts from pennies so you get a pack of three of these for three or i think it is or 150 or something like that. something really silly but this is like a soft kind of microfibric or like a cheaper version or of that kind of a cloth and on the back it's kind of exfoliating as well and um, the only thing i would say to, about these is that they do shrink so when you get them be aware of that but to be honest i literally use one or two a night with my makeup routine I mean, in the morning so it doesn't really bother me that they shrink um because when they are falling apart i just run into pennies and pick up another set so um it doesn't bother me that they shrink because i think they're really And that is off so my skin feels really soft afterwards which is great lastly now i'm just moving on to um moisturizer for a moisturizer today i'm using the image one this is um the prevention plus daily matte moisturizer it's oil free and it has an spf of 32. the reason i love this moisturizer is because it is a matte finish personally i don't like to look like the sweat is pouring off me after i put my moisturizer on Personally, I don't like to look like the sweat is pouring off me after I apply my moisturizer. I just like to kind of, I like a glow to my skin, but I just find sometimes that they can be very shiny, and that's why I like this one. Um, this smells amazing as well. I love it, and I got this in the Wexford um, Skin Clinic in obviously Wexford. But again, I'm using my ring finger and I'm applying a little amount to each area. And I don't mind going in like over extra areas if I need to but I just find that this helps me 
not overuse my product and then I'm rubbing like two euro worth of product into my elbow because I don't want to waste it. So they are just the products I use. Obviously I dip in with different products like I have a mask, it's from Yonka and um, it's a hydrating mask that I wear overnight. So depending on my time and what I'm doing and depending on how my skin is at that time will depend on my skincare routine. Um, the Elemis and the Younger products are stocked in the Cocoon Spa in the Amber Springs Hotel. I used to work there and that's where I fell in love with the products that I use. There's so many different ones, but obviously um, you will find products that suit your skin. And since working there, then these are the products I use. Um, these are my favourite products and that's why I've continued to use them. I also get facials in the Skip Wax for Skin Clinic the odd time. I'm, I'm probably doing another one actually. <laughs> but that's where I picked up my image skincare. So I do have another image cleanser and I have an image moisturiser as you've seen today. So again, it just depends on kind of what I'm using and stuff. But um, obviously I paid for all these products myself in case anyone says that um, they were sponsored or things like that. I don't think I'm that famous yet. <laughs> But anyway, I um, just want to thank you so much for watching if you've watched this far. If you have any questions about your skin, I mean, just comment down below. And if there's nothing I can do at all to help, then I will, of course. Um, but I'd love to know what products you use on your skin. Thank you so much for watching. I have loads of videos just linked down below. So if you want to have a look at those. But um, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you in my next one. Bye.